guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kayla Arne. Hey, I, I eat her. No, but seriously, I've missed you guys. Um, I talk a little bit about like where I've been and why I haven't posted, um, you know, in the video. So just keep watching. And I just want to quickly say I appreciate you for watching this, for clicking and subscribing right now if you haven't already, and liking and thumbs up this video, and following me on Instagram and TikTok and everything else. And yeah, so I love you. And remember, black lives always matter. And that's just, that's just what it is. That's just what it is. So, before you keep watching, just thumbs up, subscribe, do all that, comment below, and just keep watching. I love you. Okay. I'm just gonna do like my everyday, like go-to summer, you know, whatever you want to call it. For my eyebrows, I use the Maybelline Brow Ultra Slim Defining Pencil in the shade Black Brown. I like my eyebrows dark, honey. Dark. Since we're just keeping it simple and just focusing it on the face and that glow, we're going to hop right into the face. I'm starting off with the Farsali Liquid Glass Radiance Skin Serum. I really like this stuff. It makes me feel like super dewy and all that stuff so I'm just going to get a good amount and just like rub that all over my face and it smells good too y'all I'm excited to be here and doing my makeup I know I took like a long ass break but you know mentally it was needed and I'm glad I did it because now I'm ready to get into it. Let me go grab my lashes because I forgot them in the room. That way I don't have to like get up again. So our face is primed. I'm going to go in with the Fenty Beauty Luminous Fenty Beauty Hydrating Foundation. I'm just going to squeeze this all over my face like that. Like so. Like my fucks up. I'm just going to blend this out with my Morphe M446. This has been my go-to um, foundation brush. Don't worry about like streaks and all that from the brush because we're going to go in with our um, beauty blender to smooth everything out. I just want to quickly say like Let's just state the obvious. Obviously, like, what's going on in this country right now is just ridiculous. And as a black woman, it's infuriating. It's sad. It just, it literally makes me sick. So, I don't want to get into, like, details. Like, I'm telling you, it really took a toll on me mentally. And that's really the reason why I haven't been filming. Like, I just wasn't, like in the mindset to be filming and like sitting down and being Kayla. So I really have been, um, since the killing of George Floyd, I've been like just focusing on my mental health and just focusing on me because honestly, you are the most important person to yourself. So if you're not right, is just not gonna be right so and I've been really good I'm loving life like I said this country is just not nice and so I just really I don't know but you know this and I do want to say this is a BLM movement Black Lives Matter movement channel so if you're not into it like, I don't need that energy. I just, you know, good vibes over here. Good vibes. And I'm just going to leave it at that. Period. I'm going to go in with the Fenty Beauty Concealer. And I'm just going to, like, really... I want full coverage under this eye. By the way, let me tell you, the um, foundation shade is 345, and then the concealer shade is 330, in case you want to use me as a reference. 
but I'm already like liking how this is going because I'm in like a good attitude. My stomach feels a little weird, it's a little... but I feel good. Like I feel better than the fact that I'm here filming is, you know, because you you guys know I was on a roll. Like I was excited to be filming as often and I'm ready to get back into it. And I am. I'm actually getting ready to film another video. But I wasn't even going to film my makeup and I was like, no, like, I feel like a lot of you are here because you enjoy watching me do my makeup. So I'm going to give my people what they want, you know, but um, I'm just going to be filming a video on like, like positivity, like how to become a positive person and like what to do to help with like your mental and Cause I'm telling you, I've really been working on like self-love and baby, I'm the happiest I've ever been. Seriously, the happiest. We're not doing nothing too crazy for the under eye, but this is what we have. And now we're going in with the um, e.l.f. Camo Concealer, Hydrating Camo Concealer in the shade Rich Chocolate. I'm excited it's gonna be fun to edit and everything like I haven't done this in like what a month it's wild <sighs> but yeah What's your favorite like step in your makeup? Mine is probably the cream contour. Like, it just looks so good. Like, all you need is bronzer in your life. If there's anything you take away from this, like, get some bronzer, slap that shit on, put some chapstick on. And you're gonna be living your best life. For real. For real. And I'm like low key, like trying to hurry. Cause, well, I'm not like rushing or anything, but my best friend's coming over and we're just gonna hang out. By the way, can we just talk about really quickly? I wanna say something really quick about um, TikTok. Okay, so after the whole like, after the BLM movement really started to like take off after the killing of George Floyd um, obviously it was a big uproar on social media and TikTok had banned or blocked the Black Lives Matter hashtag so immediately when I saw that that happened I said delete now I did not I just deleted the app off my phone I did not delete my actual account because deep down inside I'm like, listen, they just blew the fuck out of me. They just blew me with, you know, they don't really seem like they're with it. Like, that's not nice. <laughs> and so I was like, fuck TikTok. Like, we don't need that. Um, now, TikTok, I've always said TikTok is for people like me, like, who like to act silly and get in front of the camera and can just be themselves like I, that's why I like the app however after that whole thing and they like block in the whole thingy I was like absolutely not like I don't support that and then like two weeks two three weeks go by and I'm like you know what well since then I did hear like they um they have like a whole like little area for Black Lives Matter and everything on the app however what I'm trying to say is I was thinking like First off, let's just say, get something straight. Black people made TikTok what it is today. Whether it's, you know, girls dancing to our music or just, black people made TikTok cool. Let's just be honest. And so I was like, you know, why do I have to, us leaving the app is like them pushing us away. It's like, no, I want you to see my black face on your screen, okay? And on TikTok, because it's such a, I do like the sense of it, it's easy to get your 
it's easy to be seen on there. So my little platform on there is like, you know, I got a little platform, y'all. Like one of my TikToks have half a million views, which is like, you know, I need that same energy on my channel. But you know what I'm trying to say. Long story short, I was like, you know what? No, I'm downloading TikTok again because they're not gonna push me away. Like you're here to see my face. So that's what I wanted to say. So <laughs> with that being said, um, follow me on TikTok. It's fun. And it's like now that I have like a, cause when I re-downloaded it, I clicked it and I was like, my video has 300,000 views. It's wild. And I'm like, no, like more pretty brown faces, pretty beautiful black people need to be on the app. Like we need to make a, a statement. Like we're not going to let nobody push us away. How are you going to use our music and then tell us we, we can't have a section on there? Like, come on. And regardless if they've like, you know, apologized or whatever, like my whole thing is you're not pushing me away, like. And then for anyone who wants to bash people who do have it, like, let's be real, you're still eating at Chick-fil-A. Let's just be honest. Let's just call it what it is. But yeah, I really don't want to focus on, cause it's, it's literally like my life, like I'm living it. So like I said, I'm somebody who I can't, like, I can't be on social media all day looking at it okay like it, it really just really messed with me like especially watching the um the video of george floyd oh my goodness like <sighs> and then like since then like so many other stories have come out and so many other killings it's just mentally too much and like right now i'm getting upset i don't want to talk no more about it because i just that's not why we're here today we're not here to cry on camera today like that's just not what we're doing so just gonna move on. Okay, so now that I have the cream contour blended out, I'm going to go in with my cream blush, which is the Beauty For Real blush and glow stick. And I'm using the shade Coral Crush. And I'm just going to, I was about to put that on my face. Um, oh. We're gonna take our NYX number four brush and wipe this all on the brush. And then like, Put it on the apples of my cheeks in like a circular motion. But I'm excited for the other video I'm gonna film because I just wanna like, I want you guys to get to know me and like, you know, just, I don't know. There's, I'm a very, very deep spiritual like person, which I can talk about all day, but I'm telling you, like, my life is just flourishing like I'm so happy I feel good about myself like I'm just there's a lot of layers to Kayla and I'm ready to start like just truly 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 like living for myself and like being myself seriously and don't get me wrong I'm, mis I'm myself I'm just saying like there's just more to me than making weird faces um, okay, so now we're going to smooth out the concealer like that. And we're going to set our face with the e.l.f. Halo Glow Setting Powder. And I'm using my Beauty Blender Beauty Sponge. This is the Sonia Kashuk Sponge. I'm just using this setting powder. I like to get any excess off on the back of my hand. And just not really, we're not baking, we're setting it. But, yeah, guys, that's what's going on. <laughs> Wonder what I've been doing? I've been focusing on myself, so. We're going to take this big old Murphy M462 and, like, get excess, and we're going to set the face. I have, like, stuff, and just, like, lightly. And plus, like, I want to just bring the, I'm going to bring more of the, um, the lifestyle aspect back, like, to my channel. 
So, so I'm taking the um, the Fenty Beauty Caramel Cutie Bronzer, and I'm just going to like contour my nose just slightly. It's already like contour for real with the cream contour, but I like to put this like that. Then I'm taking. By the way, this was a Lexi large shader brush. Then I'm taking this Morphe E48. No, I'm not. I'm taking this Morphe E53. And I'm just going to chisel this out a little bit. I like to get it on my ears, especially if I have like a ponytail or a bun. Guys, I'm getting a, um, a wig soon. And I'm excited because... First off, the hair is a black owned business, honey. By the way, please, please, please comment down below any, like regardless of if it's home decor, makeup, shoes, comment down your favorite like black owned businesses, please. Cause I, honey, like I need to be able to wear something every day and be like, oh, this is from black owned business. Like at least one thing, whether it's a freaking I don't know, but yes, please. Yes, please. Yes. Um, I'm gonna fix my eyebrow a little bit because sometimes I lose them when I have all the powders and everything going around. <sighs> More bronzer. We're gonna go in with the e.l.f. Um, Constantly Bronze Bronzer. I'm taking this big um, Real Techniques powder brush and I'm just going to hunt tea, like go all out. I'm just going to keep going. Like, oh my gosh, I love this stuff. Can literally wear bronzer all day. Loads up. I am gonna go in with a little bit of the. Where's my. The Panama Sun by Becca Cosmetics. I need some more, like. I just wanna be super, like, warm. There's something about wearing, like, a bun and then, like, just being super bronze on the face. Okay. Alright. So there's that. For blush, I'm going with this Alamar Cosmetics Color at Blush Trio in medium tan. I'm just going to low-key mix all of them, but I'm just going to mix Isla and Toasted. And I'm taking my Morphe E51 and literally just like taking both of them. This is really pigmented. And smile and just pop it on. And remember, it's okay to pack your blush on because throughout the day, your blush is the first to go. So if you have extra, it's like when that layer goes off, you still have, you know. You know what I'm saying? I want to put on a little bit of my nose. A little sun kiss action. Okay. I'm not even going to pry my eyelids because I really don't feel like doing all that. I'm just taking a fluffy um, blending brush. I'm taking the Jaclyn Hill Morphe Cosmetics um, Volume 2 palette and I'm taking G Money, which is like a caramely brownish color, any brown bronzy shade. I'm just popping that. Hold it and like... I like to elongate my eye. I hope like I'm not too far away, but I'm really not doing much. I'm just, you know, I like to, for it to blend in with my nose. And then I'm taking just a um, like a domed pencil brush, same shade, and putting that on the lower lash line, focusing it on the outer corner though, to like have like make it look like blown out, if you get what I'm saying. We're going to do a little baby wing. I'm gonna go in with the Wet n Wild Mega Liner, liquid liner. And I'm literally just gonna do like a little baby wing.
It doesn't go all the way to the inner corner is what I'm trying to say. It's just like on the outer corner. It's good enough. I'm not gonna like go too crazy because it can get real crazy real quick. So we're just gonna leave it like this. Okay, so for lashes. So guys, I believe I got these from AliExpress, but I paid like $7 for the whole thing. I mean, including shipping, okay? But I got three packs of lashes. I'm gonna link them down below um, so you can get them yourself. Um, I have A1, A6, and A2. I think I'm going to go for A2. I kind of want to go for A1. I'm going to go for A1. Aren't they pretty? First, let me go ahead and put some mascara on. I'm going in with the um, Lash Sensational by Maybelline. I'm just going to coat my lashes. As my lashes have really gotten long, and I'm not upset about it at all. My favorite glue to use is the duo glue. The clear duo glue, the brush on adhesive. So it's one with like the little brush tip. I've been using it for years. I just like to blow on it for a few seconds. Let it get tacky. And then pop these babies on. By the way, these lashes, I ordered them in like April. I just got them this month, so, you know, just be prepared for the wait. Sorry, really quick, I'm gonna put some highlighter on. I'm gonna go in with Champagne Pop by Becca Cosmetics using this Morphe E61. Any brown lip liner, this is Chestnut by Ofra Cosmetics. Then I'm taking this Pro Windsor Schuler lipstick. Um, it was a MAC Cosmetics collab in Wood Rose Luster. Or just Wood Rose. I do that every time. It's like a nudie pink with a brown undertone. Like that. Then, I normally use my KKW Radiate um, lip gloss, but I left it in my sister's car. I'm going to take this Kylie Cosmetics lip gloss in So Cute. Like that. Oh. Then I'm taking this e.l.f. Dewy Setting Spray, Dewing Study Mist. Just spritz this all over. I'm gonna cover my eyes and spray this all over. Ooh. Love that. Dry, dry, dry. Okay, guys, that's it for this look. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Super simple, super dewy. When it ends, I love it. When it comes to the summertime and like summertime makeup, I'm always, well, I go for like a dewy look all year round, but I normally go for like a dewy, super glowy, like, you know, radiate, ultra light beam type, you know, vibe, you know, you catch, you, you know the vibe. Focused on the skin, super glowy, super pretty, love it. Lashes are like the perfect daytime glam, you know, but yes. I'll have everything linked down below. I love you. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you for subscribing, all my new subscribers. Love you guys. Follow me on Instagram, TikTok. Um, everything's linked down below, okay? So, love you, and I'll see you in my next video.